Coach, uh, first, uh, how excited were you to have the head of the Charles back at the DeWolf? Oh, I was really excited. I, mean, I think everyone in the Rowan community was, uh, was happy to have the head of the Charles back. You could certainly see the amount of crowds that came out, uh, the amount of uh, participants from uh, all around the U.S. Uh, kind of didn't have the international flavor that it normally does, but I think uh, the amount of U.S. crews that were um, that were here this weekend kind of reflected what it was like when the head of the Charles first started. So, yeah, we were pretty excited about that. I know uh, temperature-wise it was very nice fall weather, but overall, what did you think of the uh, river conditions? Uh, I thought it was great. I mean, you couldn't really ask for anything better. It was, uh, it was warm. It was a little bit of wind, but it's always wind this time. But it was was it over, over wasn't overbearing. I thought the conditions were overall pretty pretty fast. And then the times uh, for your uh, four boats overall, what did you think of your team's performance? Um, I thought yesterday in the uh, the club events, I thought the guys did, did, did really well. I mean, I think they, they executed, um, I think we finished uh, fifth and tenth overall. Um, I thought the guys raced, a lot of young guys in those boats. I thought they came off the water feeling like um, you know, we, we had a pretty good performance, something to certainly walk from, work from. You know, today was, you know, I was, I was disappointed today, more disappointed for the guys. I think uh, we expected to come out and have a little more kind of uh, consistent race throughout the uh, you know, for the over the course and you know for whatever we're still still looking through it I can't really point out any one thing or a couple things but uh, guys are definitely hurt, hurt, looking for a little more speed today and uh, that's something that we'll have to kind of sit on for the for the night don't make any rash thoughts uh, after you know when you don't have to get the result that you want and then uh, you know think a little more clearly tomorrow and get back to work. Right, and you talked, especially with the club, that you had a good mix of uh, upperclassmen, underclassmen. Overall, what, what do you think of your team's depth uh, after head of the Charles? I think it's good. I mean, I think um, yeah, I think of it. We have, we have 27 freshmen and, and sophomores on the team. I think it's a pretty pretty young squad, even with the sophomores that we had last year. You know, even though they were on campus, it was. Uh, you know, we started out in the fall really wasn't too much so uh, there's still a lot of uh, still a little development that they're that they're doing and um, I know I, I think over actually over the last few weeks I think uh, we started making some good strides in our training right and then uh, finally uh, before winter break uh, what do you want to be working uh, with the team the, these next few weeks um, you know just continue to get as much uh, mileage and efficiency as we can in our rowing stroke um, you know before we you know, just really kind of hone in on our, on our on our stroke, you know how we, how that stroke develops. Everyone's clear on it, um, and then we'll do the foot of the Charles in three weeks, which is kind of our last kind of inner city competition between our, our rival schools here, and uh, and just get ready, get down to work in the in the winter. All right, thanks, Coach. Yeah, thank you.